Hello. Today I'm going to show you what Pinnacle System Studio Movie Box Ultimate includes. Well, for one thing, it includes a green screen, which shows it at the bottom right there. And, very conveniently, it includes HD editing. Plus, it comes with a very convenient program, which I have using to record right now. That's DV, you can record digital video capture. Um, this thing right here can record TV, Xbox, PlayStation, whatever. Um, I've already opened it, but I put it back in the box to look good for the video. I'll take it out. Um, right now, um, I can go plug it in and show you exactly how it works. Um, just be a second. Okay, my camera is hooked up to my computer through cords, so I can zoom in, and right now, oh, one thing is you need to have it plugged in to your computer, which, right here, and all these wires. Um, it takes a normal USB 2.0. Now, it's, the TV's on. Um, I have it plugged into my DirecTV box. You don't need the TV on if you have cable and composite video. I can't show you while I'm recording with this video camera because I need to switch to options in which is in settings. I'll have to record with a, another video camera to show you exactly what it does. Okay, so I'm not using my normal video camera right now. But when you hook this up, which sh on uh, Ultimate, it shows an output right there. You can't read it because it's reflecting. And an input. Um, there's numerous options for output S video, composite, and computer. And then input S video and Firewire digital video. Um, I plugged it into the back right here with my cable and composite. You can plug this from X Xbox or PS2 or PS3, whatever you want. Goes in there, and I'll put for the TV right there. When plugged, you go to settings, capture source, and Pinnacle 710, Pinnacle 710 USB. Click, click it. Now click OK, and. It should be loading. Okay, so I have another fault with the connection. Right now, it's connected. And I have the volume off from earlier. You can turn the volume up. Usually, this is a problem for me. It might not be for most people, but whenever I record with this, it always makes scenes, and I don't think there's any way to turn it off. So, like, no auto scene detection. I should load that. Then, what you do is push high quality, best quality. Good quality and custom quality. I leave it on full because I like high definition. Set record, push this file to pick where you want to put it, whatever. So I'll put it on my desktop. Yeah. You can leave this checked. 
I like to say that, so because I start, I start recording. If you miss any frames because you have a slow computer like me, it'll show right there. This is like 10 in 100 chance that it'll happen. Well, for at least me, and so it happened already. This entire time it's happened out of the 30 times I've used it. So, after you're done recording, push stop capture. Then, it should automatically go to edit. Very big box. Or manually. You could drag it down here, or possibly there. And when you have it here, you can put in any picture you want or background and push this little camera effects. Chroma key, you can pick a color out. Right here. You get an eyedropper, which is more convenient than just leaving it at that limeish color green. Pick the color out, and it would just take out whatever is not supposed to be there. So I chose his skin color, then it shows black for his face. I can put any picture there, which is for the green screen, which I'm about to show you right here. So I have a green screen. Um, it's about six, maybe eight by six or eight feet. Now it has Pinnacle Studio Plus, which is also another thing other than Ultimate. Plus, it doesn't include a green screen, and it doesn't include an output for your TV. So you would need to buy extra stuff. I would think Ultimate is worth more, or worth it, because it's about... Ultimate is only like 20, 15, 20 dollars more than Plus. It also includes the Studio Ultimate installation, which includes green screen stuff. So it's better to install Plus than Ultimate, so you get all of its features. Then Studio Bonus, which includes Vitacine, Hollywood Effects, and other stuff. Some stuff you will need to pay for if you want it. And manual, and it shows all these things on how to do, or how to make your first movie video in minutes. Um, it's pretty helpful, it helps me, so I'm sure it can help you. Um, so thanks for watching on things Nicole includes.